Hi traders, this is Taylor from the tradinganalyst.com. Thanks for stopping by. And we're going to take a look at the oil chart. I'm going to cover WTIC crew chart as well as the uh, USO chart for those of you that like to play the options. If you're not already a member, go ahead and sign up via the premium membership tab. We've got a lot of member benefits waiting for you. Live chat room, private Twitter feed, daily market analysis, daily member video, daily watch list, educational videos, and much, much more. It's a great opportunity, and we'd love to have you. So let's get a, a move forward with these charts here. I'm going to look at uh, the crude chart here on the daily time frame first. Uh, first want to mention this downtrend line, this longer term downtrend line right here, and that's meeting up right at about 38, okay? Uh, we've got this faster moving downtrend line, really, really nice angle right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven touches right there. Really nice downtrend line to work off against, okay? Where do I think crude is heading? I think crude is potentially heading higher. The level that's going to be the make or break for me is 30. Uh, crude above 30, and I think that we can head higher uh, potentially into the uh, downtrend line near 38 on the crude chart, okay? Now, why do I think it's heading higher potentially? Well, we have a bullish divergence here on the chart. We have a low here on the price chart and a low here on the 14 period momentum indicator RSI and then we have a lower low here in price and then we have a much much higher low here on the 14 period momentum indicator okay now the make or break level is that 30 level if we break over 30 I believe we can head up much higher okay now this is a counter trend uh, action right here because as you can see we are in a downtrend longer term this is the weekly time frame now on crude as you can see really nice angle here touches touches all right and that's going to match up perfectly with that downtrend line the slower moving downtrend line that i pointed out before which is right around 38 okay uh, careful on the long side once crude gets up to that 38 39 40 level uh, because we are in a downtrend and that is going to be met right there at that level right there okay if we break over that and close over that downtrend line on the weekly time frame then that's another story then we can head much much higher but until it does that uh, it has to prove itself okay all right so I'm going to jump to the USO chart same chart here just different numbers oops sorry about that hold on Okay, so USO chart, same chart here, same angles, uh, the numbers are just different. So it's uh, that 850 level is the level, and as you can see, we got rejected at it uh, on Friday, and then again today we got uh, gapped up to it, and then we got rejected. If we break over that 850 level, that is the equivalent of 30 uh, on the crude chart, same thing. I'm not going to repeat myself. Bullish divergence, downtrend line, uh, yada, yada, yada. Okay, so 850 above that. Uh, I do think that uh, oil uh, USO can be uh, heading much higher. All right, guys, that's it for the oil video. Thanks for watching. I really, really appreciate you guys coming and checking out the site. If you're not already a member, go ahead and check us out on the premium membership tab got a lot of member benefits that I already mentioned before and we'd love to have you it's a great opportunity all right guys have a great night see you next time